Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we have the Active Control. This is a soft start system for your RV. Guys, finally, I've been waiting for this for a while. And I've been asked about this for a while and I've wondered about this for a while. So this is the Active Start. It's basically a soft start for your RV that you don't have to hardwire, climb on the RV, install this on your AC. This will actually work for the entire RV, microwave, ac washer anything you have in your rv you're going to be able to use it with this before we had to actually hardwire this into our ac let's open this up let's see what it comes with so this is the system active start let's get this protective cover off all right this is what it looks like this is the 30 amp model so you have a 30 amp plug it's going to plug into a 30 amp generator and you have your 30 amp output so those those of you guys who have a 30 amp rv this is what you need if you're trying to get them ac started on like a 2000 watt inverter generator this is what you need so it comes with that actually it comes with the security lock so you can lock this to the pedestal if you're not using it on your um, generator you could actually secure this to the pedestal so no one can steal this thing not only is it a soft start it's a surge protector. So you get in two in one. And it's Bluetooth. So you can monitor this using your phone, iPhone or Android. Doesn't matter. That's what it looks like. I already have it installed on my um on my phone. You can monitor the current, voltage, frequency, power. That's how many times it resettable. Energy, total energy, temperature new load count so it's pretty cool you know it has settings you can go through you can actually pick what style uh inverter or generator you're using you can use an inverter small generator through 2000 watt medium 3000 medium gen 4500 or the pedestal you just choose which one you're using this is where you go to uh pick your device this is mine right here and you add your device once it's connecting this will turn green and you're ready to go i'm going to try and power my ac using this with a 2200 watt yamaha generator so let me show you what comes in the box so you got your unit it actually has an adapter so let's say you go somewhere and you just want to plug into and this is perfect for this let's say you go to your family's home and you want to plug into like one of their outlets 15 amp outlets it will adapt to your soft start so you plug this into their outlet adapt this to it and then you get power they are coming out and i am going to be receiving the 50 amp version to this so i will show you this too and the hardwire version so we're going to be testing all of them let's get this thing um, connected into the, the generator and see if we can run the ac even though i already have a soft start it still works you can still use it use this in con in conjunction in conjunction with the soft start makes it even better so you got that you got your instructions quick start guide for those of you using a generator this is a bonding plug because most generators are floating you'll have to bond it since this is a surge protector you're going to have to use a bonding plug it will detect the open ground and it won't work so put this in the open plug, plug this in, you're ready to go. All right, let's get the generator over there. Let's get you to the RV and see what this thing can do. All right, guys, so we got the generator out. I'm gonna use the Yamaha 2200 IS to do this test, 2200 watt generator on this 50 amp RV. Let's see if we can power the uh, 13,500 BTU AC. We're using this generator and the active start get this adapter so I remember I said 30 amp to 50 amp put it right here now I have my surge protection and my soft start all in one since this is floating I'm gonna use this bonding plug just plug it into any one of the uh, open 120 volt outlets it should take care of that let's fire up the generator
One. go. Now I'll plug the RV in. Well, actually, before you plug your RV in, go ahead and monitor this. We're going to connect this to the, uh, to the app. Pick this one, connect. There you go. I hope you can see this. 124 volts, 60 hertz, 73, zero amps are being pulled right now. So let's plug the RV in and see what happens. You see it's pulling right about four amps. Okay, I'm gonna go inside and turn that AC on and see what happens. Let's just see how many amps this is pulled. Okay guys, as you can see, the AC came on with no problem. It's pulling right at 10 amps, 121 volts out, 122 volts, 60 hertz, 1,218 watts. So not only is this good for a surge protector, soft start, you can have this inside your IRV and monitor your power and everything you're doing outside without having to hardwire. And it just plugs right into your generator and you get all the benefits of the soft start. All right, I'm gonna climb my RV and show you exactly where I have to install my self start. All right, guys, so this is the AC on the top. You have to actually come up here and hardwire your self start on the inside of this box right here in order to get it to install. In order to have self start, you have to come all the way up here and hardwire it. Okay? With that self start system, you don't have to do none of this. All right, guys, let's turn the AC off. Okay, guys, so we just tested the active start system. This is a 30 amp model. Um, I am going to be doing a lot more testing on this thing. I just wanted to show you guys a quick uh, demonstration of it, what it does, basically what it does, you know, help you start loads that normally cannot be started by a small generator so if you have a 2000 watt generator and it bogs out when you're starting the ac get you one of these it will help you start it all right if you go over a family house and you plug in the 15 amp plug plug one of these in to help you start those loads so you don't keep tripping those breakers all right all right guys if you like this video go ahead and give me a thumbs up as usual hit that thumbs up button hit that subscribe button guys thanks for watching this channel have a great day. Bye.